Hey guys, welcome to Supercars of London and Throwback Thursday. This week we are back here at the haunted houses of Hertfordshire. <laughs> so we're back at the haunted houses of Hertfordshire and a quick sneak preview of a very special Living with a Supercar video that's going to be coming on Halloween. I'm going to be spending the night here. <laughs> I'm going to vlog. I'm going to be spending the night here um, in my car, which is going to make for um, quite a scary video and I'm not looking forward to it, but um, I thought that it was a pretty cool idea. This week on Throwback Thursday, I'm going to be talking about the video where the Lamborghini Gallardo LP560 Bicolore was teasing the police. It's had just under 5 million views from when we uploaded it in July 2011. Check out this footage. This comical video that we filmed back in 2011 has got quite a lot of stories behind it because um, first of all the owner of the car was a, a very well-known resident of central London and enjoyed making a lot of noise so every time that he was driving around it was our cue to film him hopefully we could be able to get some good accelerations now when he got pulled over by the police for not having a front number plate it's only a 30 pounds fine I think um, and it was just quite funny that the owner was um, in good spirits and so was the policeman the door's locked and the lights just come on. I'm not even gonna look. I'm not. Uh, I'm getting back in the car. So we were talking about the um, Lamborghini T's and the police and the owner and the policeman were having um, a bit of banter talking about who would win in a race between the BMW 5 Series police car but also against the Lamborghini. So um, the Lamborghini thought that he would outrun him. The policeman thought that he would outrun his fuel. So it was quite funny to film. Um, I was filming on my video camera and we also had the co-cameraman who was filming for Supercars of London as well back in the time. And um, it was just a hilarious video to film. And uh, as soon as he got back in his car, he was revving it up. Then he uh, was, the policeman said, What was that? <laughs> the uh, policeman said, don't boot it up there, otherwise I'll come and nick you. He booted it, but he only booted it to like 20 miles an hour, but the car still made a lot of noise. I was filming it. We had two cameras at the scene, and um, unfortunately, on the train, I managed to delete my footage, which meant that we had to, we only had uh, one uh, bit of, oh, that's my car. Uh, one bit of footage that we were able to use so we uploaded it to YouTube. It's now got about 5 million views um, It's probably one of my favorite comedy moments from the Supercars of London YouTube video archive uh, We've gone through some amazing sounds some amazing tuned cars and also the funnest uh, the funny dumbest rich man in the world and also the argument that caused with the Lamborghini this video, um, I think some people got the uh, wrong interpretation of the fact that it was teasing the policeman. Um, we could, we should have mic'd up the uh, owner of the Lamborghini and the owner of the policeman for you guys to really fully hear the conversation. And the funniest thing was that I caught on my video, unfortunately we weren't able to put this online because I deleted my footage, was the fact that the Lamborghini then went through a red light just round the corner to escape the rest of the traffic away from the policeman's eye. I'm not grassing the owner up because I'm not sure he's still got that car um, but it was it, it was funny at the time so that video um, in 2011 a bad year for supercars really in 2011 there wasn't that many uh, cars that came over from the Arab states um, and it was also very very wet I do remember it being very very rainy uh, but everyone decided to uh, put their roofs on Lamborghinis that year um, 2012 the Olympic year for London was also very busy not many supercars so the 2011 2012 there wasn't that much that went on but um, the Lamborghini 
Mancini teasing the police. Um, a great video, one that um, I always look back and laugh on, purely because I knew exactly what was happening uh, before with the guy uh, giving us some awesome acceleration videos, and then obviously during with the police and having the uh, banter, and then after him going through a red light as well. It was it was pretty uh, funny. So um, that's Throwback Thursday this week. I'm definitely definitely getting out of here. It stresses me out every time I come here, but. It's sort of the home of Throwback Thursday. Like I mentioned in the beginning of this video, I'm gonna be coming back here and spending a night by myself in my car for living with a supercar. I'm gonna see how this puts up with, um, as a hotel room. Um, not really too keen on doing it, but we'll see what happens. Thanks for watching. I look forward to seeing you tomorrow for the trailer of Living With A Supercar and then the first episode goes live Saturday at midday. So make sure that you're tuned in um, and looking out for it. Not the best way to end the video anyway, but make sure you take care and I look forward to seeing you soon. Thanks very much for watching. Bye bye.